Wise Owl, 8th of the July, 2021. And before I start, well done to England, who got through to the, their first European final in over quite a long years. Well done, England. But enough of that, back to the bird news. How our nation's symbols soared back from the brink. The fierce beauty and proud independence of this great bird apparently symbolises the strength and freedom of America. But as Letter Day citizens, we shall fail our trust if we permit the eagle to disappear. The endangered New Zealand tern, seen in Australia the first time. Bird watchers are marvelling over the sighting of those endangered <coughs> back, black fronted tern on Australian shores. It's bird academic to New Zealand. Birds throughout the hemisphere could play for Utah's water mistakes. A great as a lake lower and lower. No one is quite sure how the pelicans or other bird species they call the lake home will respond. Sick and dying, sick dying songbirds now in 53 in Indiana counties. As officials still search, the Indiana Department of Natural Resources repeats its urging. We just did that one, but there's a, a little bit again. Saying they're dying in the mid Atlantic songbirds. Mystery illness is killing mid Atlantic songbirds. Website where life officials are asking people not to breed, feed birds, or provide bird baths with dozens of mysterious songbird deaths. First, Piper chicks hatch on Ohio's lake, here it coast in 83 years. Hatchings are a major milestone in Great Lakes piping plover. plover Restoration efforts. Conley of shy Albion pelicans flourishes during pandemic. GVR Jara, Alabama. The pandemic has brought one great thing to Western Albania's Dava Kavir Legion. Barely needed peace and quiet. Camera equipped Taraki, Taraki surprise researchers. New Zealand fluorides to provide new safe haven for penguins in a warming world, new research suggests. And that, my friends, is the end of Wise Owl News. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.